What's Gucci gang? What's Gucci squad? It's your boy Young Mike back at it with another five video. So the end of the world is now here. What I mean by this, it's not going to be the real end of the world, but on December 21st, something big is going down. So December 21st, everybody's been talking about it. You probably heard about it by now. This is when the fake end of the world is going to happen, guys. What's going on, Mike? What's happened on December 21st? This is what's happening on December 21st. We're not only having Jupiter and Saturn collide like they usually do, and then they disattach, you know what I'm saying? We've had that before. Now, when that happens, nothing really happens as far as like a, a change in the world. So, nobody really pays attention to that stuff. But this time, it's different. This time, the whole world resets itself. What do you mean by that, Mike? This is the most craziest thing that's ever happened in mankind's existence. You're probably watching this video and thinking I'm a stoner. Well, guess what? All the people that don't think I'm just a stoner, be awake in their conscience right now before it even happens. If you get in a car accident, what happens? The person in the passenger seat is most likely to die than a driver because the driver knows that he's about to crash. You know what I'm saying? Like he's already prepared and mentally prepared for a car crash. Now the person in the passenger side is not mentally prepared for that so what happens to that person is he actually has a higher chance of dying look it up it's true it's true facts so the people that are not woke and this happens they have a higher chance of not only falling for the false messiah not only falling for some bs they're gonna be most likely to die and not saved the people that have a woke conscience right now like me is it's building that conscience i can't sleep at night no more my days are going faster. The, the the nights at nights, I'm not having sleep. The reason why I haven't been getting sleep is because my dreams have been coming true. One time I had a dream that me and my homie, we were cruising and then boom, I crashed the bins. And two, three weeks later, randomly, we're cruising, driving, and I crashed the bins. Now, okay, that's one thing, but dreams been happening and they've been coming true or a vision. So December 21st is called a solar alignment. So basically a solar alignment is Everything is going to line up from the moons to the planets, bro. I'm talking about three moons to all the planets going down. So on December 21st through December 25th, that's when this is going to happen. It's going to take that amount of time. Now, December 25th, when is that? The birth of G, the birth of G, the, the birth, birth of Jesus. Jesus. Now, what the fuck does that even mean? They're fucking tricking us, y'all. They're tricking us. The son of Christ, the son, the son what do you see on all the crosses around the whole fucking world? The circle with the cross. You know what that means? That's paganism. And what is paganism? They worship the sun. Why do people go to church on Sunday? To worship the sun. Sun day. Sun day. S-U-N. Not S-O-N. S-U-N. Saturday. The day they worship Saturn. What's happening right now? Saturn and Jupiter is about to have. They call it the great collision or the great. The great conjunction is what I meant to say. Now the great conjunction has happened before. Not only in our lifetime but before our lifetime and it's happened many years before that as well but this time is something like no other time that we had before this time all the planets will align so basically we're living in a world today that was set up before we were even born y'all but you know how you have the aquarius you know you have i think i'm a leo all that stuff so during that time period it was the time period of the bull and then after that time period they stopped worshiping the bull and then they moved to the to the ram and that's when jesus started uh talking about the ram and all that stuff so it was actually playing out in the bible guys so in the bible it actually is telling us the facts but this is what we don't know but this is what we now know you know what i'm saying because on december 21st through December 25th we're peaking on the Aquarius now that is the the birth of the new year you know what I'm saying it's the birth of it's January that's the birth of the new year now this is not only the birth of the new year but this is going to be the birth of a new world but this is the crazy part about what's going down on December 21st through December 25th y'all probably like okay the planets are gonna align who gives a f well guess what man this is where you should give a f because the planets when they align this is what's gonna happen it's gonna open the domains we're on one of the domains. We got another one above us. We got a one on the bottom. We got a one on the bottom. Let's just call it like an onion. Let's say we're living in the onion as our world. Now, we're living on one layer of the onion. The top layer, bottom, 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 whatever. You know the case may be. But it's going to open our domains to where we'll be able to travel into the other domains. People like to call it like an other parallel universe almost. But basically what this means is... 
above us on the top layer, let's just say they're 3,000 years behind us. And on the bottom layer, let's just say they're 3,000 years in the future. And we'll be able to travel through those domains. The government, they're saying that they're not gonna be able to travel through the domains. That they're gonna trap us in our domain. Now this being said is like, what the fuck is really going on? Why are we gonna be trapped in this domain? What's happening in this domain that we don't know about? Why can't we travel to another domain? If the world's gonna end in this domain, supposedly on a fake note, we, we want to go to another domain. Whether it's 3,000 years in the future, we can't go 3,000 years back. I don't know about y'all, but I need YouTube and I need technology. They put an image in our head that wasn't real. And I've been known this. I've been told my grandma since I was like 12 years old. I've been told her, if the government is evil, doesn't the government put out stuff like put out the Bible? If the government was so evil, why would they allow the Bible to come out and people to get saved? Without twisting it up in some type of evil plot. And that's what they did. Christmas. All fake. 25th. December 25th. That's when. That's when it's going to happen. So the 21st and the 25th. Doesn't that sound familiar? That's when Jesus rose from the dead on the 25th. So basically, guys, we got two months until it's doomsday. Share this to a friend. I'm not trying to scare nobody, but warn them. I'm not warning you to be scared. I'm warning you because this is about to happen. I'm warning you so you could be prepared. Also, another thing, guys, is when this happens, when the, the planets align, an electromagnetic field that will start from the North Pole will go all across the whole world. This will cause an instant electromagnetic wipeout to the whole world. That means no YouTube, no, no porn hub, no electrical cars, no computers, no Wi-Fi, no phones, nothing. We will be blacked out. We will be living on a dark earth. Candles and all that, we will have light. I will have a lot of weed to smoke, guarantee. From the jump of this year. They were distracting us for the end of what was coming of this year. From what's coming of this world. It's going to be the new world order, y'all. This is what's going to happen. In the other domains that are 3,000 years in front of us, they have the possibility to come back here and try to take over our domain as well as theirs. We have the possibility to go to Mars, which is going to be 3,000 years below us. So basically, Mars is going to become our planet sooner or later you know what i'm saying like all these planets are gonna have sustainable life sooner or later because of the transitions of how it's going but for us as a human race and i learned today because i just lost someone our bodies are just a body it's always it's gonna be here still when you die your body still will be here you feel what i'm saying your body doesn't die with you so we're just living in this body it's really hard to understand. But when we die, we will not be in our physical bodies. But we will still hold memory. Water holds memory. What has been here since ages? Water. Guess what they don't want us to have? Water. Our fucking water supply used to be good back then. I remember I could drink out the faucet. Now there's sodium fluoride in our water supply, which is really bad for you. It actually causes you health problems. And on top of that, say you boil that water. I dare y'all to boil that water. Y'all will find out that it's white stuff at the bottom when you boil it. That's all sodium fluoride, the stuff that you find in toothpaste. Why do they put this in the water? Because water is key. Water is medicine. The sun is medicine. When this happens, they're going to use this as a plot and a trick for the fake messiah. So even me, I'm thinking this is going to be the end of the world. It's not going to be the end of the world, guys. This is not when the real God will come, even though this when you think he will come because all the planets are going to align. This is some really godly shit. This is some miracle shit happening. You know what I'm saying? But there will be false messiahs. You know what I'm saying? There will be the false antichrist tricking us, guys. So we have to be careful. We have to be knowing our, our stuff. I'm about to hit this car right now. Gold on gold. You know what I'm saying? At the same time, because I'm stressing. So basically, y'all. We got two months until they're going to fake the doomsday. It's called Project Blue Beam. Now, they're going to have aliens that are going to come, supposedly. You never know. They might come from the other domain. Now, they're going to come 3,000 years from the future and fuck us up. 
and they're gonna have we're gonna have something called the reptilians and i know this sounds like a fucking movie but this is the truth and they're gonna save us supposedly and take off those aliens out of here and the aliens is really gonna be us because we're gonna fake it but really we don't even know if they're really gonna come from 3,000 years in the future unless we already been in 3,000 years in the future because this probably already happened and they're running it back and forth and this could be key to time travel guys like i said we could go back 3,000 years we could go ahead 3,000 years this alignment this alignment is actually making time travel possible y'all probably thinking like oh this sounds scientific and, and bullshit this is not bullshit guys i'm trying to warn y'all this is actually gonna happen december 21st through december 25th and then this will last seven days they say this is the seven days that we will be judged and we will have the rapture and all that stuff now this might be a fake rapture a fake seven days of fake everything because nobody knows when the end of time will be so this has to be all fake but they're gonna use this excuse of this planet alignment natural causes of this natural electromagnetic waves wipe out it's gonna be looking like the end of the world money's not gonna matter no more the whole society is gonna break down in just two months y'all two months share this with a friend share this to your family member share this to someone you love i'm telling you all straight facts this planet alignment earth will never be the same y'all i'm just gonna tell y'all like that it will never be the same make sure you live every second like it's your last I, I know that this is going to end soon, but my, my, my spiritual body will forever be. You know what I'm saying? My spirit, my, my soul will forever be. And it holds memory, just like water holds memory. Water is not a person, but it holds memory. And I'm, I'm a soul. Everybody has a soul, y'all. You are someone inside. My body is just a body, you know what I'm saying? My body doesn't make me. My jewelry and my clothes doesn't make me. The person inside that's talking to y'all, the person you hear, even without a voice, it doesn't make me. I could talk, I could not talk, and I could still feel the vibes and meditate, and I could still feel myself on this earth without talking, without walking. I could still feel my presence on this earth. Without anyone around me, I can still feel other people's presence because I know I'm not alone. That being said, we don't need our bodies. Spiritually, mentally, and physically, I'm awoken. That we're all about a physic physically, we're all about a physically feel what I'm feeling right now. And how I'm awoke is how all y'all are gonna probably be awoke after watching this video, after doing some research. Go on Google, feel free. They won't tell you much about this because, like I said, this is all planned out Project Blue Beam. The government will hide as much as they can from this. They don't want this in media. They don't want this in the news. So today we learned a lot. Today we learned what's going to become of December 21st through December 25th. And we also learned that a whole bunch of bullshit was going through the Bible with the Son of Christ. And also December 25th, the birthday of Jesus. And also this alignment is on the 25th. Y'all get the deal, man. Y'all learned that. And about paganism. And how time travel is possible with these planets aligned for seven days. So remember, guys. When this happens, do not be followed for the fake messiah. It's your boy Young Mike. Let's get 6,000 likes for the next video and I will drop another banger for y'all. Let's get it.